so hi guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl benedicta again for those that don't know me my name is benedicta i'm a mom of three i make videos on um, hospital blocker family life a little i'm in i'm new to um youtube so i don't really know how to make videos so i'm always saying this so don't judge my imperfection i just have to pass the information that i can not to make a super super perfect video but if anybody can help me so i can get a good video i will really appreciate it so i have gotten a lot 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 of questions that people have asked so before i start this video i just want to say i am very sorry that i am not consi uh, consistent i have not been making video the way i used to make i have gotten a lot of questions people want to do this hospital but they have lots of questions they need um lots of answers to be clarified so that they will know what to do i just want to say that i see all your questions i see all the things you've been asking me even some acts of my contact i try to put my contact down but i don't really know how to write this but i think when i'm editing this particular video i'm going to see if i just write it on top so that you get my contact maybe my instagram or my facebook account so that you can ask anything you want to ask if i know it i'm going to answer you if i don't know it i will still let you know that i don't know we are not perfect we are all still learning i'm still learning so i want to let you know that i've seen all your questions I see everything i'm not ignoring anybody but i have a lot a lot in my mind my the traveling we just came back from nigeria so the preparation to travel and everything plus work plus children everything just caught my attention that i see some messages i just click like i cannot even respond i respond to very few i cannot even reply i know all that i'm supposed to reply so i just want to say i am very very sorry so today i have some question that will quickly um, answers answer the question as you know i don't really like my video to be very long so i'll see how many questions i can answer then i will continue with it so because the way i always do my video is answering questions you know from question i get a uh, motivation of another video to make so today question i want um but one question is from someone i don't i didn't write the name i only wrote the questions down she said thanks for encouraging us is it possible for someone without science subject at high school or university to get an husband as a nurse yes why not i did banking and finance and i did um when i came to germany they recognized my banking uh, certificate that i did diploma uh, I said diploma um, bachelor in banking and finance and i worked two years in the bank and i got two years of experience work but i came here i couldn't um work i couldn't they, they, in fact they didn't recognize my certificate they only recognized my certificate as i get mine actually rifle niche as ba uh, not as a bachelor or not as a banker from which is what i am so i have to switch to look for something else to do that is how i find myself in nursing um so many berata they send me to many berata some of them encourage me yeah you have a good certificate you can work in the bank you can work in the industry you can be an accountant they were tossing me tossing me run round and round taking me from one place to another but in the end i end up doing the hospital because that was the only place they could accept my language and everything so you can study nursing with anything you have any degree whether it's degree whether it's a um, um, school sato whether you do art whether you do commercial whether you did science whether you did banking accounting economy social study education anything you study back home it doesn't matter what they want is at least you have certificate that shows that you can read and write that's it so number two question thank you so much nurse b with this hospital can i come with my kids you cannot go to school with your kids you need somebody to help you but there are few where i was living somebody that i know that was going to one hospital school i think i mentioned that before i think is bv cannot remember the name they have a where they keep kids 
so you can keep your children there and go to school you, that's your child that cannot go to kindergarten so but it's better for you to look like for target motor or space in kindergarten then you can start but in the hospital some hospitals still have kindergarten so all these things ask whether when you are going for your first loan express ask whether they have kindergarten whether they have this whether they have that and don't let them know that uh because so you don't have a place to keep your kids because that can disqualify you just by you are asking that somebody say they used to have so you can just ask maybe you might be lucky the place you go to or they might say okay we are we have kindergarten clothes here or kindergarten inside like where i did my practical before in mateza inside they're just driving in you will hear children crying making noises and this that it is kindergarten that is there whether it's kindergarten whether it's target motor i don't know but i used to pity for these children so much because 5 30 even me i'm still feeling sleepy these children are already there their mother dropped them there to walk inside so the kindergarten or target motor i didn't really go to look it is but i know i always hear noise of kids you know hearing the teacher talking or somebody taking care of them that is talking so i always hear sound once i'm driving in you know because they put a slope there so you have to slow drive when you are there so because of that i always hear all those things and i always say in my mind oh god these children they are awake by this kind of time you know so with that i know that okay people are bringing their kids people that are working there they are bringing their kids and dropping there so that is why how i find out that it is possible in some not all i have such uh, number three person i've searched for your video in elton Flega hair farin i can't see it can you maybe post a link yeah you can't see elton Flega hair farin because i don't talk about elton Flega hair farin because there is no elton Flega hair farin again it is now Flega fat assistance Flega fat assistance is still like Flega heparin and it's still like gesundheit and cranking Flega uh, heifer so that is what it is now they don't call it ethan uh, Flega heparin or uh, gesundheit and cranking Flega as heparin as the assistant they don't call it that way again they only call it now Flega fat assistance so i talked about it is the same if you get the certificate you are still a Flega heparin and uh, a uh, Ethan Flega FRN is still the same thing. So if you are searching for my video of Ethan Flega FRN, you will not find because I write I used to write it as Flega Fat Assistance. I have a lot of video of Flega Fat Assistance. So check you will see it. I must be I am in Nigeria and so interested in the nursing assistance hospital. And I have started learning German because I'm determined. Do you know of any company that can um, take their international candidates to B2 level in Germany. I don't, I don't really know. I will say, I will say you Google, you Google to find out, or maybe you search for other people's video. Maybe they will talk about it. But for me, I don't know because I didn't come through that way. Like I always say in my channel, I always talk um, about what I know, what I've done, because with my experience i can just be talking here blah 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 because i have the experience i've gone through it you know some i ask people i you know with that i get the knowledge but things that i've not done things that i've not i've not even made research of such things so i cannot um, advise you on that i'm sorry but i will advise you to search on internet you might see and when you see always ask all the questions you want to ask you know but what i know is that you can you are the one that will if you want to come as a voluntary care to work as a nurse, you are the one that will go to a language school to B2, uh, A2. A2 um, is okay. That's what I know that many people are using. I've seen people that they accepted A2. A1, A2. Once you finish the A1, some A1 doesn't even take up to two months. You go to A2. Before four, six months, you are done with the A2 certificate that you used to apply. My sister-in-law is doing it. My niece is doing it. I've said it before. They went, they searched. My niece is in Abuja. My sister-in-law is in Lagos. So they searched it on their own. It was not my help. And they got it and they are doing it now. So with that, you can apply to come as a voluntary care. You don't need to go to up to B2 in Nigeria. So the fifth question is, please, what level is required? I don't understand what you mean by what level is required. I don't. What you didn't um, specify what you which of the level you are talking about. Is it level of language or level of education? If it's level of language, level of language. If you are living in Germany, 
to be in us is B2 that is required for Flega Farcraft. But Flega Assistant, they are still accepting B1 in some place. Some place will say you still have to have B2. But B1 is okay for Flega Assistant, which is Flega Fat Assistant. But for Flega Farcraft, you need B2 of the language level. Then for other requirements, which is like your school SAT, you need your school SAT. And your school SAT, you need to first of all translate it to German language. After it's translated for German language, you go and do this uh, big big glau big gong. You take it to start, they will look at it and they will stamp it that okay, they've seen your certificate and they accepted your certificate. After that, before you will now send it for recognition, which is I in a I have video that I've stated all this information. So it's step by step. First of all, make sure your, your certificate is with you here, whether it's secondary school, Wayek, Neko, anyone you did. Whether it's bachelor or diploma or uh, polytechnic, anyone you went to, you bring it here. First thing, as you get here, what you need to do is to translate your certificate. Not that you are the one translating it to you. will look for, go to Google, you see it. You look for people that will translate it. You will pay money up to 200 or so. They will translate your certificate for you. So once your trans uh, certificate has been trans translated, you now take this translated to, to, to start house. It's the start house that they will give you this here, uh, be gum. It's just a stamp on that your certificate that they translate. They will stamp it on it. So after that, before you will take it for recognition, which is INE Keno. So once you're, you have been recognized, they can grade you to anything like bachelor degree. That's the one I know. I, I don't know somebody. All my friends I know, they have bachelor degree. So all of us, we have I the mine Uk Shule rifle. So people that have um, diploma or school sad O level, I, I don't I, I don't know anyone, so I don't know what they recognize their own as. So I think I have answered the requirements. So I'll answer one more question because my time is running. Um Vaspasiet, this one asked me, wrote it on Dutch. Vaspasiet bitte nach dem Vorstellung gespräch und wie kann man Dish bitter and ration. Okay, I just said it after I just said how you can reach me. I'm going to write my what's my uh, I think I'll write my WhatsApp number too. Then I'll write my um, email address, my Facebook, and then um, my Instagram. You can reach me there. And what happened after the first long after the first long respect, they will write you. They will write you to tell you some some of them will say, tell you immediately there that they've accepted you some will say okay we'll get in touch with you and they'll write you to let you know if they've accepted you or not so if they've accepted you they will still write you that they've accepted you the next thing you will get is um paper for you to bring this bring that feed this your you know contract paper all the things they require they always require so many things a test from your doctor that you are healthy enough uh furong soikness that you get from police so many things birth certificate your children birth certificate they require so many things so many things like now that there's corona they still need that uh, yellow paper book you photocopy all those things your certificate you photocopy everything you know birth certificate everything you bring it so after the the first language fresh if you accepted this is what the next thing is so <laughs> i'll end this video here i still have lots of questions the question is much i have more than 40 questions so i've been able to answer seven and i'll answer the rest in my next video thank you guys and have a nice day please if you have not subscribed to my channel kindly subscribe as you can see we are growing we are up to 300 plus and i'm so happy thank you everyone thank you all my sisters um brothers and everybody i really appreciate everything please don't stop asking questions ask questions i will do my best to answer them now that i am stable i'm back no more traveling no more this no more that it's just me and my job now so i will have time now to answer a lot of questions so have a nice day and bye bye